The creation of this reality begins at the young age. So all the textbooks um, and all the history books are, are then written and, and, and so, that when, so that we all collectively believe this particular thing. So then we all, when we all believe it, we all ma ma manifest a reality that's based on these books. Yes. Uh, that's very sneaky in a very mm -hmm. clever way to yeah. do it because how do I know, how do we know the textbooks are um, they're not. The, 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 the wars are written by the winners, mm. aren't they? And so the winners write whatever they want to write in there, mm. and then, then we just believe it, we take it on board. So, we, so we, start, we start learning that numbers and letters are, they only give us a very simple version of what numbers and letters are, and there's so much more to what numbers and letters are. Uh, even phonetically, um, uh, how 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 a word sounds, how you say it when you speak, how it sounds to a person is going to affect them. It's not just a word. You know, I think I wrote the other day. You know, and I think you know people know this, but um, you know, you spell a word because it's words spell. are spells. Yes. You say a sentence to somebody. You're you're literally saying a spell. And words are, you know, that, that old adage, sticks and stones, and I break my bones, but words and you know, names, names will never hurt me, is, is, is not true. Yes. Yeah, because words are very, very powerful. Yeah. I go further and say thought matters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Literally very. matters. Yeah, yeah. Well, thought creates matter. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. And all our words yeah. are endorsing that. Yeah, reinforcing it yeah. all the time. Reinforcing yeah. it. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. You said something um, a moment ago um, to do with uh, the vampirism mm. that goes on on this planet. It, it is a vampiric yes, consciousness. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, no doubt and, about that. And um, from my own spiritual journey, I would say that that is a, uh, where we've forgotten who we truly are mm. along the way because we're self-sustaining mm. when we're connected to our true self directly to source yeah. and what religions do and many of the other belief systems do is it it cuts us off from that and we're placing our power to something else yeah. rather than our own unique self yes and when you mentioned followers yes Take again it's not about followers because yeah. every one of those people are individuals yeah. with their own uniqueness yeah. to find yes and and what you're doing is sharing your uniqueness yeah Yes. But you don't want people to copycat. No, and, I don't. And definitely don't. And I don't want, I want also people to discard what they don't agree with what mm -hmm. I'm saying. If it doesn't fit for them, mm -hmm. fantastic. Then don't, then let that bit go. That's, that's okay as well. And I'm definitely not, a hundred, nowhere near 100% correct. I just, mm -hmm. and I'm on the, I know that I'm on the right, I'm pointing in the right direction. Yes. That I definitely know. Yes. Um, uh, yeah, so um, it is. It's this. It is parasitic. The consciousness mm -hmm. that's here. Sometimes I see it as imagery of like maggots, like a maggoty sort of energy, energy that's sort of like it just eats through. Eats. It, mm -hmm. It's. 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 Its mind is about. Its mind. Its thought pattern is conquer and destroy. Mm -hmm.